hair and everything. You hit the red button whenever you're ready. I'm there. Did you already hit the red button? I did. You want me to stop the rubber? Yeah. All right. This is Dr. Timothy Lineski at Lake Cumberland Rheumatology. Uh, today we're going to be doing a uh, trigger point injections. There are many different ways that you can do trigger point injections. I tend to use them a lot with fibromyalgia patients who tend to have most of their symptoms or a lot of pain in the trapezius uh, up in the cervical spine region. So today we're going to do uh, two trigger point injections. Uh, when I said there are different types that you can do, some people will do multiple injections in one muscle. Uh, I tend to do uh, one central injection. Instead of using a little bit of fluid, I tend to flood the area. So today we're going to do that. So first, we already know where we're at and where we're having some pain, so we're going to clean off these two areas. I use a cold spray, ethyl chloride, and an injection. This is uh, about 90 percent um, lidocaine and just a small amount, like 10 milligrams of methylprednisolone. Uh, you can skip that and use just normal saline if you want. So we do a cold spray, pinch. This is up by the lung, so you want to pinch up some of this skin so you don't go into the apice of the lung, and we inject. And that's it. That's a trigger point injection at Lake Cumberland Rheumatology. We uh, appreciate you all uh, liking us on Facebook. Uh, leave some comments or let me know if there's another video you'd like for me to do for you all. Thank you.